Uh, approximately 3.20 this afternoon, Hamilton Fire received a report of a structure fire at 221 Kenilworth Avenue North. On arrival, crew had heavy smoke visible in the uh, building. Crews uh, attempted to go inside and do an uh, interior attack. They were met with heavy smoke and uh, high heat in the building. They were managed to do a uh, primary search in the buildings. Uh, as conditions started to worsen, uh, crews were pulled out. We now have a situation where we have uh, four buildings in total uh, on either side of number 221. We have a commercial building on the bottom, residential buildings on top, heavy fire conditions. Uh, we've been at this for uh, over an hour and a half at this point. Still have uh, heavy flame uh, visible through the roof. It's broken through the roof and we've had some structural collapse. At this point, we have uh, two uh, individuals that uh, were assisted uh, out of the building by fire who have uh, been treated by uh, paramedics for smoke inhalation. We have no injuries to report for firefighters at this time. This uh, fire is well involved and uh, we certainly expect to be here for uh, quite some time to try and bring it under control. So uh, absolutely, it is, it is a hot day today. Uh, we've got high humidity conditions. We have our Box 43 rehab unit on scene, providing uh, nourishment and uh, liquids to allow our firefighters to replenish. One of the things we do is we bring extra crews into this fire, make sure that people have a chance to uh, dump heat, take off their gear, uh, be able to get some uh, liquids and some, uh, and some nourishment uh, before they go back into the fire. So we're very cognizant of that. Uh, the last thing we want is a firefighter going down from heat exhaustion. How, how many crews would respond to So at this point, uh, we're at a third alarm. Uh, we're approximately uh, 50 firefighters. Uh, that may be changing as we're now increasing to get additional crews here to help contain this fire. You, you mentioned